Yo, what's up my kings and queens? It's your boy Kingshot and I'm bringing you guys a commentary today on some demolition. It's gonna be live. Got some stuff to talk about. First thing going right off the top is I might be changing my name back to Frost or something else. I really am looking for ideas really at this point. So if you guys have any ideas for a name, just hit me up in the comment section below. Um, I'm not really going to be affiliating with any clans. I'm just going to be rocking dubs with my boy Abyss. I love you, bro, if you're watching this video. But I'm going to be uploading this video even if I do quite bad. But I got some stuff to talk about. First thing is that I got it's kind of more of a small talk thing, but I do want to mention it in the vid is that complexity. If you follow competitive, which I'm going to give you an update right now, I have not played. I played one game of Arena where all my teammates left, so I don't really count that as my game. But I have not even played looked competitive in this game. Like, I'm not even kidding either. Like, I have just been completely ignorant towards the competitive side. I just have not touched it. So, with that being said, if you guys do follow the pro circuit and whatnot, Complexity, the team that did it all in that 14 win streak, they came back together. Not the original Complexity squad, though. The, um, there's this new Complexity squad that consists of Ricky, Miracles, Parasite, and Nameless, I believe. I'm not for positive though. I just got punched in the face. I was 5-0, and almost had my lightning strike. Anyways. Well, uh, they came back together, and I thought that was pretty cool how the uh, Complexity Squad came back together. You know, I find that pretty cool. Oh, okay, those guys are all over there. Uh, this video is being recorded on a Sunday, and it's probably going up on this very late on Sunday night. I cannot play on the weeknights, which is really frustrating. Uh, it's just it's how it works in my family. But, okay, okay, okay. I had a couple of ideas for videos. If you guys are okay with this, and that's how I'm saying, like, I have to ask you first. If you guys would like to see short video clips, now what would be my short video clips is, like, for instance, a 30 second video of me getting a 1v4 clutch or something, you know, like something like that. I know that wouldn't might not happen in 30 seconds, but, and I, something along those lines, like where it's like 30 seconds and I'm getting a 1v4 clutch. Just like a short little video, but it's a little clip, you know, it's pretty cool. If you guys would like to see that, just hit me up in the comments and let me know, because I would definitely like to post those to you, because I do have a couple cool clips on here. I do like this game, and I do think it's really good. But the biggest reason I like this game so much is because of the simplistic fact that it requires positioning. What is that, you ask? Right now, I'm not in a good position to kill this guy, but when I get on this head glitch, oh, look at you. I just I just used that head glitch to my advantage. I got the shield. I, I want to cut that guy out. But... You know, you have to use stuff like that to your advantage. And I know that glitching is kind of annoying to most people, but... Okay, that kill right there was disgustingly dirty. Okay, but... You, it requires positioning, and I think that is, like, the most important thing. This guy's got a hater. He got one last time I tried to record this vid, so... Congrats to this dude, and I that dude will not die for some reason. Oh, shoot, he's got a trade on me. Shoot, I gotta back off. They're about to blow up that bomb site, which is annoying, but it's what happens. Friendly UAV. How did he not? How how is he still alive? Peek it, Bucko. He just will not peek. Targets. What a social vision. Get on the bomb, defuse teammate. I believe in you. But yeah, if you those kind of video video ideas would be cool. If you guys want to see UMGs on this game, just hit me up in the comment section. Again, guys, I really need your help. I really do. Because, like, I need to know, like, what, what you guys want to see. Because, of course, I only run this YouTube channel because I think that you guys like to. And I make the assumption that you guys genuinely enjoy my videos. So, I just figured, you know, like, I want to tune it to you guys. Because you guys are the ones that keep me going, you know. So, figured, you know, like, keep me going. Ooh, I'm actually getting on a tear here. Let's see if I can get another. I'm just going to play aggressive here. Okay, that was a lucky kill. Ooh, there's that Scythe. I'm just saying right now, guys, that Scythe for some reason has this aroma of a two-shot kill, and it makes me so angry. Like, I just feel like sometimes I just get two-shot dropped by that gun, and it just really grinds my gears. Alright, let's go ahead and anticipate calling this Cerberus. One lightning strike kill. No more? Okay, that's fine. 13-2 and two right now. I'm doing decent. This guy's trying to flank. I'm gonna go ahead and kill this kid and get my streaks. Go ahead, Cerberus. Go ham. That name is really cool, the Cerberus. I know I'm probably pronouncing it wrong, but... 25 points off streaks. This is frustrating, to say the least. Okay, I got it. Alright, let's call in this Wraith. You know, we're on purpose. Let's put it over mid-map. Now I can play a little bit more loose, because I already got streaks and everything. I'm not going to play super loose, but I'm going to play a little bit more aggressive. This 
guy for some reason is trying to flank us. Wow, Wraith, go ham. Almost jumped off the map. One thing I do have to complain a little bit, I touched on this in my first thoughts video. If you guys haven't seen that, I'd recommend go watching it. Because I do kind of base some of my stuff off in that video. But, I just do want to say that one of the things I do have to, like, give a little bit of bash on is the fact that you, like, toggle in. Like, right now I'm not holding down my trigger and I'm aiming in. It's kind of annoying. I have gotten used to it, though, so I cannot complain too badly about it. Because I have gotten used to it. Like, it's quite easy. Now I think about it. I thought it was going to be, like, really hard, but it's quite easy to get used to. You just got to take the time to learn all your controls and everything. But, you know, it, it does it does happen. And you just get used to it. So, with that being said, I don't know why, but they are not uh, pushing us. Maybe we're just getting killed out of their spawn like my Cerberus is doing work. I don't know. I just don't know at this point. I think I'm going to push out a little bit be more aggressive. I'm using the Rejack ability, guys. Ooh, Cerberus, go ham. I am using the Nomad character, which is the Rejack guy. I know it's kind of nerdy, I guess, in a sense. Like, it's kind of, like, frowned upon, but I just think it's a good ability. It has been nerfed, so I don't really think that it Friendly can be dinged inbound. too much. This guy's jumped around. Oh, I just gave away my position for no reason. Don't hold back. Okay, get out, get out of the wall. That wall running is pretty cool. I do have to admit it. It does remind me of Titanfall, which I did actually enjoy that game before it kind of crashed. Okay, that was a lucky kill. I gotta back off. I'm gonna wait for them to push me. Watch this. Look at this play right here, boys. Look at the smart plays coming out of King Shot. Look at that smart play coming out of King Shot right there, dude. Okay, I gotta run. I gotta run. I gotta jet. I gotta jet. I gotta jet. I gotta jet. Let's wait for him again. Don't tell me I just did it to him twice. Dang, I played that kid like a fiddle. 23 and 2 is... It's not that good. I was pretty campy that game. I'm gonna be honest. I did. But this play right here, you can't can't say this is campy because I played this kid like a fiddle. But I'm genuinely enjoying Black Ops 3, guys. I have 20 hours played on this game. And I genuinely enjoy this game, guys. I'm just saying, this is a game that I will enjoy grinding. I, I have been playing this game, like, nonstop. I haven't even touched any other game, like... Literally, sometimes, guys, I like to, like, play Hearthstone on my PC. I don't know if you guys know what that is. It's, like, a popular card game. It's, like, a, it's like from the World of Warcraft series and stuff. I'm not in the World of Warcraft at all, but I am into Hearthstone a little bit. And I, used to, I, I usually, like, play that game. I haven't even touched the game, which is saying something, because usually that's, like, one of my staples. Like, on the weekend, I'll be like, hey, I want to play a couple games of Hearthstone, you know? This, I haven't even touched that game. I'm not even kidding either. Like, I just haven't touched it. So I just kind of bait this kid out, which is awesome. I was able to do that. Uh, let's actually retreat a little bit before I call in my, uh... This guy is trying to be on the hot sauce flank, and I'm not having that. Alright, let's call this bad boy in. See what I can do. Requesting lightning strike. Right, let's pick up this, um, DMT. There's one. There's the second. There we go. Cerberus, come in. 200 off another Wraith, which would be absolutely fantastic at this point. Absolutely fantastic. So I'm just gonna camp right here. That was a lucky kill. Alright, let's see. Does he hop on bomb? No, he got me. Okay, that was why I used reject right there. Because I died. I got the credit for the death, but I was able to stop him from defusing the bomb. What was that? Oh, a hive. Ouch, that must have hurt. Because I thought I lagged for me. I was like, what? So 31 and 4 is not that bad, guys. But. Yeah, if you guys are enjoying my commentaries, drop a like, because, oh gosh, yep, I knew I was dead the minute I turned that corner, I was like, I'm dead. <laughs> yeah, but this game, I, I genuinely give it a good review. I don't know if I like it as much as Black Ops 2, it's too early to say that, and I don't know if I like it more, well, actually, I knew know the answer to that question. I do like it way more than, uh, well, I don't know how my teammate didn't die there, but I do definitely like it more than AW, for sure. AW is just too bouncy. Now, the game does hold a special place in my heart because, like everybody, it's like, oh, bash on the old Call of Duty. I, I do genuinely think it was a decent game. It wasn't a bad game, I, but I don't think it was necessarily an amazing game by any stretch of the imagination. But I do think it was decent enough. I know this guy's flanking because I hear him. I am. I do not have any professional gaming products. I do not have a scuff. The I, I do have a $60 headset, which is really nice. I love this. Here's that stupid Skype again. But I do genuinely like this headset a lot. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of them. They're like a cheap, like, $70 headset company. They are quality. Let me just say that much. Wow, that guy just got destroyed, dude. That guy just got straight worked. I'm just going to sit right here. I'm really close to kill streaks right now. I think he's going to challenge me because he thinks I'm weak. Yeah, what a goofball. All right, let's see here. Let's call on this lightning. All right, let's get him. Let's see if we can get three kills. That's my goal right here so I can get my streak. 
Why you gotta be so nice, Call of Duty? <laughs> well, there we go. Hopefully we can go for this Wraith right here. They are just destroying this bombsite right now, dude. I'm not even kidding either. They're like going for this bombsite hard. So, what's going on here? I'm just camping right now. Let's get out of here. Skedaddled out. There's another. I know he's spawning over here. I, I just heard him spawn over here. I could have sworn to you he spawned over here. Let's call him the Wraith. Alright, here we go, guys. Here we go. This is a long game, guys. If you're sticking around this long, I do appreciate you guys watching my long booty videos. Love you guys. Man, this is the dream right here, dude. Doing YouTube videos, man, this is, this is the dream. Oh, gosh. I just saw all those rockets go off in that guy's face, dude. There we go, Wraith. Go ham. Wow. 49 and 5. That is an extremely good game. I was one off the 50 bomb, but I ain't even going to be salty. That's a good gameplay right there. But, anyways, YouTube, if you did enjoy the commentary, please drop a like. If you're new to my channel, look at that guy get destroyed. Drop a like for that. Oh, and his body flew back for you, too. But, if you did enjoy the video, please drop a like on the video. And, if you're new to the channel, please hit the subscribe button. It helps up a lot. It helps out a lot. What the heck? I don't know how I got third place right there, but whatever. So, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.